Hey GTI fans, welcome back to another episode of Imperial Galactic Survival. This is your host Zelot, and we are here today doing a new series um, dedicated kind of to 7.6 really, and uh, some of the changes that they've done, and, and I'm just going to run this series until, um, I'll see how far I can get anyway, until the... Uh, Iron Man starts up in a couple weeks, so um, what I want to do is I want to run a custom scenario that I have subscribed to, and that is uh, the Xerox Invasion Search for the Souls Lost City. <clears throat> so um, let's check this out here. Let's, uh, uh, let's do all, we'll do four ones. We'll set that, see what that does. <laughs> I, know. I don't know. Uh, it's just going to be different placement of stuff, right? So, <clears throat> but the actual land I think is now set permanent. I don't know. Uh, I like to do my own settings. What I do is the, uh, I usually go medium and then I go to the enemy settings and switch all that to hard. And so the hardest settings for the enemies. And then I just run with that. Okay, and then let's choose Let's name this. We'll call this um, Sauls. And let's do starting location. <clears throat> no. Uh, Stars of guns. No, I don't want to do these prison breaks and all that. I just want oh, Earth. Earth. Start at Earth, eh? It looks kind of a kua -y. I'm hoping to find something to them for thirst for blood, guts, and lots of killing. <laughs> Learning the games. Near, okay, so recommended for really experienced OCD players only. Huh? Okay, it's a chilly desert with small lava ponds. And snow-covered rangers. Okay. <clears> hmm. <throat> no. Uh, vast oceans and dense jungles and some massive rain events that last hours. Very low visibility. Nope. Uh, visibility. Nope. Um, hmm. <clears throat> Planet where you start in a drop pod. Hard start, but beautiful alien with mountain ranges, lakes, and massive open plains. It's not breathing. Huh. Uh, 15 rad. Ow. Nope. <laughs> Mars is 22 rad. It's just, you're going to start with like medium armor probably and just die from radiation poisoning right away, right? That's kind of, I mean, that, that would be just, you, you're like juggling ways to get rid of radiation right off the bat it's just insane i don't know i don't know if i need to do that look at night big radiation on a lot of these so here we go this might be a little bit so let's put it over there. of course start with less than the drop pod Ooh. <clears throat> hmm what else do they got saturn just a pistol. Okay, no. Uh, tricky medium. Tricky medium. Uranus. Lots of modern bacteria that breathe. Many of them. So I think a slightly loopy player would try. Yes, that's you. Drop pod start. Okay, a slightly loopy player. Okay. So I kind of fit the bill of that, don't I? Well, let's go to Uranus. 
Here we go. We're going to Uranus. And we're all set. Seed 1111. Let's do this. <clears throat> Come on. So, drop pod starts. Hey, I like drop pod starts. The base starts can be, I don't know. They can be okay, I guess, too. Oh, we'll just continue on that. Something to do with the scenario, I guess. A minor. We'll see if we continue to get errors, we might not be able to run this scenario. Uh, that looks like a POI, a shooty POI over there of some sort. Yeah. Uh, oh, look at all the stuff in the ocean over here. Huh. Let's uh, let's just try the ocean. Can we do the ocean? Oh, that's trippy. <laughs> We're still falling. Okay, the ocean is like super deep. And tons of rocks, really? Awesome, okay. Wham. Okay. So, come on. I hit F. Uh, still, wow, that's a huge loadout. 250 of each ore. Lots of stuff. I don't know about, that's, fine. I mean, we got an O2 generator. Oh, we're kicking ass here. Okay, so where are we in the... Whoa. Okay, these are massive, massive, massive ocean with just a couple of small land masses. Okay, this is going to be tricky. This is going to be tricky. TS Uranus. Admin Bank Missions. Okay. So, you know what? That was a admin. Oh, but there's another POI there. And another one there too, right? And another one there. Because they're going to be all crowded all over these things to fit. Well, I think we got to go down there anyway. I think we should head in that direction. So, um, I'm going to actually go into third person view I know a lot of people don't like this view because it swings them around too much but sorry it's just it just can be easier sometimes with the uh, the field of view is a little bit better without actually having to adjust the field of view if you know what I mean I don't need that I'll grab this and do I need anything else down here that's not bad uh, okay, so I'm not cooking from radiation, right? The rads are super low. It's not going to bug me. So it's just oxygen that I got to monitor at this point. Okay. Okay, so how much energy? We've got tons of energy. So we, as soon as we put that down, we're going to be fine. So let's, um, let's start smashing this stuff and we need to pick everything pick everything unfortunately I don't see any seaweed that could be really bad that could be really really bad I'm level 2 already that's cool Okay, let's make sure I'm still going the right direction. Yes, I am. So, I haven't done a water start in a long time. I It just hasn't been viable. I guess now they're putting stuff back in the water. I don't see any seaweed, though. That's a little, it's a little bit of a drag. Getting lots of other stuff. I don't know if any of this stuff spoils though, right? I gotta get up on the land and pick some 
regular stuff. Wow, good resources down here, though. So this is interesting. They've got, uh, I guess they had animals here. Um, okay. <laughs> That's fine. Wow, look at all the stone, all the, wow, it's just... There's a lot of stuff, but no seaweed, so so that is a bit of a problem right now. That's okay. Level three already. Okay, so now that I'm level three, I should... Um, you know what I'm going to do? I've got all those ingots. I'm going to... Oops, no, I don't need that. Come on, this one. Blueprints. I'm going to go and... You know what? I've got the... I've got it. I've got enough stuff. Let's do... I'm going to do the Econo hover box that I just... I modified it. So let's send that to the factory. And I'll publish this later. So it's a slightly cheaper version of the hover box with a little bit better stability. So it's, there's a, a, sac, a couple of sacrifices made to make it a little bit cheaper, uh, but it's not bad. It's not too bad. So what do we need? We need uh, 116. So 116 and 156. Fifty six and eighty six, so it's pretty cheap. Pretty cheap. I don't know why I just did that, but <laughs> so eighty six. Okay, we'll start that. It'll be ready in fourteen and a half minutes. In the meantime, we will keep crushing this rock. So I guess we've got to get up on land here pretty quick and start picking stuff. I'm, I think I'm heading in the right direction. There's a lot to pick. And smash. But there is no seaweed by the look of it, so that's, yeah, that's going to be a problem. Hmm, let's get that on. Well, there's a big iron deposit. That's nice. Can't I can't get everything that I see because they're also I'll never leave the water here because it's just like it. This is like a plethora. The whole ocean seems to be just a big mining bed for rocks and, and alien thorns and uh, pentaxid. So we'll go up here and let's get rid of our weapons here and we'll swim a little faster <clears throat> and uh, we'll try and not die pick 
like stuff along the way, obviously. Oh. Seem to swim without a weapon a little bit faster than just walking along the uh, bottom. Yeah, it seems that way. It seems there's definitely a noticeable speed increase. Lots of good stuff. So we're still, we're doing okay on time. We were already, the thing is, is we're already got a vehicle cooking. Like instantly we had something cooking. So they, they give you a, a, a bit of a chance really with the start like that. Like, wow, you just, all you need to do is get enough stone together to really, um, to just to make a platform or you know find a POI and spawn on it I guess so we'll be coming up out of the water we still got quite a bit of time before we've got quite a bit of time before we have to really buckle down and build a base now is is this actually underwater is this ore deposit underwater no that would have been a little interesting if it was Swim a little faster here. So another iron deposit somewhere. We'll be coming up out of the water pretty soon here. You can finally see the... <laughs> Took a while. Okay, some copper over there too. Good. We find silicone, that'll be the uh, trifecta. Um, Pentaxi, or not Pentaxi, but uh, Promethium would be really nice too right now. Okay, so nothing here to kill me. There shouldn't be yet. I still got, still got some time. If we go west, so let's... I think now I will equip a, well, actually I can just equip this. So let's, let's run. It's over here. I want to try and get s some veggies, corn or something, right? Uh, it's going to be hard to spot in this grass. It's going to be really hard to spot in this grass. Another copper, we need silicone. Wow. Uh, that was quite the rock full. Okay, we are getting stuff now. Eggplant parts, I think. I think, uh... I think those egg parts. Oh, a farm. Ooh, hey, there we go. We might uh, we might get lucky here. We might be able to take something over. I'm not uh, against that at this point. And, ooh, there's something else over there, though, that does not look friendly, necessarily, or is it? Is that the other, 
admin or is that a drone with it? I don't have a weapon that I can zoom in with. Hmm. Well, this is quite interesting up here. It's like a plateau island, kind of lush. It's all green. Kind of cool. So I do want to go over there. I don't know if that's a drone hanging under this. See, that's scaring the crap out of me. Another iron. Wow. And level four. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Corn dogs. Here we go. Is there corn too? Is that corn? No. But corn dogs. Keep getting these eggs. Oh, so yeah, that is a drone. Okay. And another drone. So, okay, it's guarded by drones. I think we'll just leave that alone for right now. There's other. So that copper is going to be really tricky to get then. Bank missions. So there's a drone stuck on the admin term. Wow. Okay. I might be able to go up and kill that then if it's stuck. Hmm. Let's not chance it. Let's just keep going. We're almost running out of daylight here. And we got to find a place to uh, put down an oxygen generator. We need we need to get settled in here pretty quick. So I'm going to run west. That'll give me more time. Nope. Oh, corn dogs. So they're a little easier to spot up here. Is that corn? No. Uh, corn dogs. I'll take them at this point. Beggars can't be choosers. And I got to start thinking about oxygen really quick. I got to get over to that uh, trading station. It's okay. I am collecting stone from the rocks too, quite a bit. Now these ones will take too long for me to smash with this drill. They are smashable and you get a lot of resources from them, but and they got to sit here for half the night working on one. It's just not worth it. It's not worth it unless you have a vehicle that's really capable of doing stuff like that. So we'll head over to this iron deposit. See if we can discover anything else along the way. Pick everything we can. You can see my time is going up right now because I'm, I'm running faster than the sun. Isn't that amazing? So I'm prolonging the day right now, heading west. More iron. Wow. This is an iron-rich environment. Corn dogs. At least they're easy to spot. There's a ton of stuff to pick. More iron. 
it's crazy. Silicon, okay. Okay. I don't need to pick every egg at this point. There we go, level five. <clears throat> nice. Nice. Very, very nice. So there's some big iron deposits right below us. I think I need to get some of those. So what I'm going to do is let's just... Let's just really quickly, I know we've got, we've got enough right now that we don't have to kill ourselves preserving this stuff. So let's drop these right now. So let's get that down and we'll get some of this going. We'll just get one in there. We'll take some right now. Okay. So while that's brewing oxygen, <clears throat> we can eat some of these. Can't eat those, but we can eat these. Now, poisonous bite. Do I have anything for food poisoning? Bad trip. Um, I don't have anything for food poisoning. Radiation poisoning. Oh, I had rad pills. I have rad pills. Okay. That's good. Uh, I don't have anything to protect me from food poisoning. Ooh, okay. Well, that's fine. That. We can put down this. Oh, there, my blueprint's already ready. Nice. We haven't even put our uh, survival constructor down. We just finally have. So let's just put a bunch of stuff in there right now. I guess it doesn't really matter because I'm going to be picking it up pretty quick. Uh, but what we can do is we can start getting this stuff processed while we dig. So let's do that. So we can do that and that and that. And we can make a we can make a starter and we can make a bunch of concrete. So we'll do that. Okay. There we go. Get those going. Okay. We've got that food there, and I guess we can kill stuff if we need to, but right now. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh. Oh, crap. Something's coming. Something's coming. How am I going to hide? I'm not going to hide. I can't. I, I have nowhere to hide. Nope, he's he's not coming. Oh, so something's over there patrolling. <sighs> Damn it. Okay, so let's. That's okay. We'll just. Damn. Let's just try and get some of this ore really quick then. Well, we've got stuff brewing in the, uh, oh, let's go like this, tab in, tab out. I want to see if that thing starts getting too close to us. hide down in a hole if it does start coming. It's not a bad idea actually force it to come more direct overhead. Okay, 
come on. We'll get a couple of these nuggets at least. Hit that was 117. Wow, that was really good. Uh, I'm thinking I'm gonna have to kill that thing to get over there. That's not good. Yeah, I must be patrolling one of the... Is it patrolling the trading station? That's kind of weird. I've never seen... I've never seen them patrol trading stations before, so... Okay. Let's move on. Let's move on. Let's see what we've got here. Another four, so we can get that. Good. Need a little bit. If I get food poisoning, I'm screwed. Okay, let's pick this up, and we'll pick this up, and we'll grab the stuff. Come on. Okay, so let's keep going. I've got a base starter. I've got some <laughs> concrete made, but not a lot. And I don't know what I'm going to do about him. I might have to kill him. He's infringing on my my area I might have to come down here it's not a bad idea anyway nothing can come this direction it's going to be so let's do that let's do that let's scope out down here let's do that it's going to get dark awfully quick. We should have a full night's grace, though, before stuff starts spawning. It shouldn't start spawning until first daylight. Or, well, the second daylight, technically. <laughs> Let's turn our light on now that it's dark getting darker uh, I guess what I should have done is did, did I actually have a motor yeah I got a motorcycle kit so I should probably make that I should make that right I can do that really quick so let's do that let's do that Playing with fire with those corn dogs, I tell ya. I usually get poisoned right away from them. Okay, let's pick that up. Those red, the red arrows drive me nuts. Okay, so let's put this down and we'll head over there. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> this down again. Head over there. Bump the F and eject off. That was fun. Whoa! <laughs> that was fun too. Uh, oh, really? It might. Come on, let me. Come on. Really? Okay. Oh, yeah, I'll line it up even better. Come on. Am I, am I screwed here? No. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Oh. <laughs> I hate the motorcycle. Come on, there we go. And, uh, oh, it's actually climbing. It climbed a hill. Ooh, can I climb this hill? No. No. It can't. <laughs> come on. Come on. You can do it, motorcycle. Can you 
Can you? No? No? Oh, finally. Getting a little bit of traction. Here we go. And, oh, here's a nice little sandy. Okay, that's it. I've had enough. <laughs> no, I didn't want to do that. I wanted to hit shift at the same time. Okay. Oh, my. Okay, so there's the barrier right there. Don't mind that at all. We've got, got a kind of a cool beachfront here. There's iron over there. Water. Okay. Well, considering that the whole frickin' planet is almost water, um, finding water is not too difficult. I just want to find a place that goes into land, into sh into land, and and goes up really fast. And I'm thinking over here. Somewhere around here, maybe. That farm's not too far away. This is looking pretty good. This is looking pretty good. Yeah, this looks really good. Okay, so let's set up here. We've got nine minutes to set up. Just gonna throw this down again because we need to get this in there in particular to get these concrete blocks going. I guess I can throw these and they're gonna take forever to expire unfortunately. I can just throw most of the stuff in there for now. stuff on me. Okay, I can move this into there. Okay. Okay, here we go. And almost done. Let's grab some more of these. Okay, we'll let that cook. Uh, in the meanwhile, we will put down, no, we don't want to put our base down there. We want to put <clears throat> our oxygen down and get that going. So we'll put another one of those in there. Okay. Okay, so now we don't have a lot of biofuel, but we do have a lot of stuff that can expire, which is good. We don't have a lot of corn dogs. Unfortunately, they don't supply a lot of food anymore to you. Well, that's okay. It's kind of keeping me alive for a bit here. Okay. Let's get digging. So I want to dig straight in from here, I think. So let's do that. Tab in, tab out. Hopefully this doesn't take too long. They did make the drill a little better in Alpha 7. It auto picks up and is faster. They also increased the speed of the T2 drill, basically just making the um, the land the the dirt clearing feature of the T2 drill, they just made that the also the drill regular or drill feature too, so that's the speed, it was really fast now. So the T2 drill is really awesome. 
Okay, so am I still... I'm going down. That's why it's changing color. Okay, so that's not what I want to do. Go down. So, a lot of times, I can get a little fence up just in time before critters spawn. Sometimes not necessarily. And they can, they can get into the little hidey hole that I dig. So we'll see. We've got seven and a half game hours, which translate into, I don't know. Um, oh, I've got some, God, what horrible digging, really? So, which, so that's too deep there. So this is more right, this is correct here. God, it's okay, I'll fill that in with concrete. We'll just pay paradise and put up a parking lot. So it's really critical to get deep enough so that it's hard for the... That's annoying me. Let's get rid of that. It's critical to go deep enough so that the drones can't get a clear shot at the core. So. So basically, it's a bit of a time race right now before the sun comes up. When the sun comes up, if I'm not safe, I'm probably going to die. So, we got to make a safe spot. Sometimes I'll just build out in the water and build a my own little island out in the water but I like digging I like digging my own base it's kind of cool okay so that's not even close to far enough really I gotta keep in mind my biofuel consumption. So this is a bit of a boring part of the game, and if I have enough time, I, but I don't know if I will, I will try and fast forward through this. I'm still learning the editing software, so I haven't really done any of the editing yet, so to speak. I'm still refining my skills with it. Facing Okay, that's not too bad. Hmm. 
Didn't I? Haven't I been picking up any stone from this? I don't see any stone. Do I have? See, I haven't picked up any stone. Huh. Huh. I guess this type of ground, you don't get any. There are ter certain types, texture types, that you don't get any stone from. I guess this is one of them. Oh well. That sucks. That actually really sucks. I was not expecting to not get any stone from this. Huh. Hmm. That actually is a big drawback at this point, because I don't think I had a lot of stone anyway. That could suck. Okay, so it's... I think we... <clears throat> Yeah, we're at the point now that it can't, they can't actually see. So we're just going to dig a little to the corner a bit here. Just a little more. We're going to dig down. Okay. So now what we're going to do is we're going to line up our avatar in the direction that we want the tiles to go. So I think we want it to kind of go in that direction there. So when I place the core, it'll all line up in the way that my avatar is facing. <clears throat> Okay, get that sunk right down like that. And then we'll get some blocks on it here. Okay. Now I'm not sure if that's the actual floor level. So at this point, what we're gonna do is we're going to hit our N to bring up our building tools and we're going to select connect to base. So while looking at it. Okay, so now we can place these blocks wherever we want. <clears throat> so we need to start building a fence. So Start there. As good as anywhere. And we're going to get under them. They uh, looks like they're not perfectly under it. Come on, come on. We want to make sure the structural integrity is is really good. Come on. It's not letting me pull them across. Come on. Oh, that's it. Okay. That's fine. And another one. Okay, so we need more. We need more. Um, hmm, we're not going to get a lot. Yikes. I might be going swimming here pretty quick. What I might have to do is just make sure that 
Okay, so I can I can try and I'm not gonna get much of a fence, unfortunately. I'm not gonna get much of a fence. It's just too big. I won't be able to be able to pull this off. <sighs> And I need enough to spawn the HV, so I can't use up all these. It's really weird that I didn't get any for drilling the uh, hole. Okay. Start bringing this down. I'm hoping they won't want to walk on the blocks. Okay, let's see what I can do on this side. Hopefully we can get down to the water. Looks like we might be able to. That's good. Come on. Get under there. Ugh. Really? Okay. Whatever. Okay. Now we're going to look for <clears throat> slightly low spots. And just put a block there. Okay. Okay. Not bad. Okay, I think we're going to be okay. I don't think they're going to get up on the... the wall that I've built to, to, to fence them out. So, it's a little low there. There, okay. Um, and I should actually extend this a little bit to give me some side cover. Okay, good. Okay, so 27 blocks left. 27 blocks left, and I need to see where the water level is going to become. So right there. Okay. Let's see what happens here. Hmm. Looks like I'm going to have some digging to do. Yep. Might be able to spawn it out here. Just drive it in more too. 
Let's move back a bit. Or here, I can jump up on here now. Let's just chance a couple more bites. Okay. Two minutes left. Wow. But I think I've got a big enough fence, so we should be okay. <clears throat> and that is not going to be big enough to spawn it. I've got 15 blocks left. <sighs> got to make this wider. So which way is wider? It's this way. So i got to pick up my constructor. Well, not maybe not. Maybe not. Let's just dig. Dig, take this out a bit. <clears throat> I don't necessarily have to have it underground right now. I'm not going to activate the base. I just want to get a, um, a spawning pad going here. If I can get this HV up, then I should have enough resources to deck it out a little bit to uh, make it more functional. And it'll help me construct this base because it's got a mobile constructor on it, which is much better than a uh, survival. Well, it's not much better, but it's better than a survival constructor. Okay. Okay. And first day is almost up. Let's get this dug out enough to spawn this vehicle in. Oh, not gonna let me. Come on, there you go. I think once I get this HV up and running, it's going to make life a lot easier. Actually, I know it will make life a lot easier. I just got to get it up and running. Should be big enough. Should be big enough. Cleaned up a bit. And some more blocks. We don't have many left. That's okay. Oops. <clears throat> okay. Well, let's see. 
Let's see. Can we get this spawned in? Can we get the HV spawned in? <clears throat> Come on. You can do it. There we go. It, it'll spawn. Right there. <clears throat> Excellent. There we go. There we go. And we've got 30 seconds left. Nice. Okay, so this is a slightly cheaper version because it's only got two thrusters in each direction. It does not have an ammo box. It's got a it's got less cargo boxes. Uh, although I did extend out the front pontoons to the sides a little bit more and that has added quite a bit of stability actually so it's a little bit more drivable so I think this will do good though it'll do good um, so let's put all the stuff into it so we're just gonna grab all this stuff Oh, actually, we'll leave that in there. No, no, we're picking this up. So, yeah. Okay. Then we'll pick it up. Put this in here. Mobile constructor. And we'll just put all this stuff in here. Okay, well, that'll spoil, that's fine. Just put all that in there too, it doesn't matter at this point. Eat some more corn dog. And again. Oh, we're running out of corn dogs, but I think we'll, we're just in time here. Oh, lots of oxygen, that's awesome. That's really awesome. Okay. Okay, we're in good shape. We're in good shape. I mean, we don't have tons of food at this point, but that those are four full-time food. So if we if we completely run out of everything, we can do that. Um <clears throat> well, guys, I think I'm going to leave it here. So if you like this episode, like and subscribe. And you'll be notified of the next episode if you set up your notifications after you subscribe. And once I've downloaded the next one and published it. <laughs> so there we go. We've got a bit of a tunnel dug. Or at least started. And I'm going to have to go find a bunch of rocks. Uh, I could go hover out in the mid middle of the ocean, I guess, and just use the drone. and smash a whole bunch of rocks and get some more resources and I think that's not a bad idea but unfortunately right now I need food so the next episode I'm going to do something to increase my level get me food um, and get get us some more resources to boot so stay tuned that'll be in the next episode uh, until then um, I hope you guys have an awesome, awesome day.